Hi guys, welcome back to another Sonic Screwdriver video. Today we're going to be taking a look at this classic series Sonic Screwdriver from the episode The Hordes of Nine One from season 17. Now this Sonic Screwdriver is quite unique in the classic series because it doesn't belong to the Doctor. Yes, as you probably guess from the title, this Sonic Screwdriver belonged to Romana, Romana 2 played by Lala Ward. So yes, this was the fourth Doctor's companion's sonic screwdriver. This is, uh, as far as I know, the only companion in the classic series that had a sonic device. It makes it quite uh, quite unique in that circumstance. And yes, so this replica was made by James Sutton from Scarecrow Props. Very nice bloke, does loads of great little props and things. You should uh, go and check his page out. And without further ado, Let's have a look at the stand over here. So, as you can see, it's uh, pretty basic in shape and design. Pretty small. It's got electrical tape and some milled lines and holes there, which have been painted black. And some more lines up here. So you get up to the top and middle section, got some yellow and green tape, yeah, it's there, very nice. A lot of people think it resembles an aerial, I suppose it does a bit. And onto here, so I'd imagine you'd hold it like that and this would be the control section here, there's just some four black dots on either side which have been milled in there, nice and straight. And yeah, more tape on the handle there with a nice hole right there for, uh, I don't know, if you want to put it on a keyring or something. <laughs> but uh, yeah, it's really nice. It's the probably the most accurate you can get to the prop. I know Rubbito Replicas sold a few of these replicas a few years ago. And the prototype for that one was actually made by James, who made this one. So literally the same thing basically. Uh, now I do actually have two of these. Uh, one of them I got quite a few years ago now. It's an older version as you can see. It does look slightly different. This one doesn't have the hole and it's also got white tape instead of the dots but uh, other than that very, very, very similar. So this is the one I did have in my collection for a few years now. It's been on the shelf. And I'm happy to get a updated one that looks more accurate. Uh, what I'm gonna do with this one is probably, uh, probably customize it maybe. We'll see, we'll see. But yeah, for now, I'm glad to have this in the collection. Uh, what I'm gonna do is I will bring in my fourth Doctor's Sonic Screwdriver from RB Replicas and this is just a little, little comparison here as you can see it's quite nice they look quite good together they're not too uh, similar in size you can see that the Romana screwdriver is actually just a tad bigger than the uh, fourth Doctor's but these are from different people so I'd imagine if you've got James to make a fourth Doctor screwdriver, I think they sit in scale quite nicely with each other. But uh, yeah, it's not too bad really. And uh, it's a great little prop to have. I think actually, I shall get this one. Does that fit in there? Oh, yeah, look at that. There's a little, uh, little attachment there some sort of weird triangle. I can uh, do a little scanner. I can give you a look at it like that. See, I'm just being silly now. <laughs> but, uh, but yeah, I'll keep you updated on what I do with, uh, with the older one, see what happens to it. And for now, I'm happy to replace it with this one on the shelf. Nice little display. So yes, thank you for watching again, guys. And I will see you next time. Bye!
Three, one.